Hey guys, this is Austin, and today I'm here with an unboxing of the iPad Mini. With an all new size and lower price, it looks solid, so if you're interested in winning one of these, be sure to hit up that subscribe button to catch my giveaway. To start, let's get at the box. This is the white 16GB Wi-Fi model, but beyond that there's not much to see here. With some help from a knife, we can make a quick incision to get to the good stuff. Now we just need to pop the lid, and bam, we have the iPad Mini. For now, let's set it aside to see what else we have in the box. First off, we have a bit of info, including a quick start guide, incredibly boring, I mean important safety info, and the Apple stickers. Who doesn't love Apple stickers? You'll also find the USB wall adapter, which is a bit smaller than on the full-size iPad, and the new lightning to USB cable. This replaces the 30-pin cable used in previous iPads, and is much smaller and reversible. Now for the fun part, the iPad mini and all its aluminum goodness. The first thing that jumps out at you is how absurdly thin it is at only 7.2mm. The bezel is much smaller than the normal iPad, and here you'll find the 7.9 inch screen which unfortunately isn't a retina display. Up top is the FaceTime HD front facing camera, and around back is the 5 megapixel eyesight shooter. Along the right side you'll find the volume rocker and a switch to mute or lock orientation, and up top is the sleep wake button, microphone, and a headphone jack. The bottom is where you'll find the lightning connector and your stereo speakers. Set the iPad mini next to a 7 inch tablet like the Nexus 7, and you'll see it's quite a bit larger, especially if you try to hold it with one hand. At first glance, the new iPad mini is looking good, but be sure to stay tuned to the channel by hitting that subscribe button to not only catch more videos, but also the iPad mini giveaway. Don't forget to drop a thumbs up if you enjoyed, and I will catch you guys next time.